once again she's got some bat onto it or is it the pad that's boundary and runs here is wide nothing on it you have to be spot on that's exaggerated swing as you said hasn't been an Slightly full as hit hard, traveled quickly to third and first runs off the bat. Won't race away to the boundary. We'll pick up a couple. Oh, inside edge. Still gets the single. This time a leading edge and gone. Short cover takes the catch. Pakistan have their breakthrough and a big one. Gabby Lewis trying to work it on the onside. You just get a feeling. Fatma Sana was creating those dot ball pressure on Gabby Lewis. This time just head falling. Wasn't in control at all. Direct hit would be out. Oh, and what happened there? Why didn't the bales get flicked over? That was a huge chance for a run out firstly and the direct, direct head would have done it but again I think Muniba totally missed out where she was standing down the track over the header that is a brilliant shot one bounce and over the ropes oh, look at that nice coming down the track good follow through also An excellent result well what a start from Amy Hunter to this over extraordinary stroke down the track getting there's a little bit of turn on offer, but generally just skids on. Big swing. There's a feel. Oh, you can't get it. Just bouncing right before I shouldn't have seen the digicy young talent. As we see, certainly in the history of the Irish women's game, I believe. Maybe. Again, that's lofted over. Beautiful. That is a shot and a half by Ola. We're down to 17 overs. Down the track. Mid off, mid on up free swing of the arms the power and the timing that these two possess for two such young cricketers 117 120 years of age oh how did that miss how did that miss good run very good running that is top class straight very straight but there is protection oh she can't get it off that's gone through for four. Ease with which she comes down the track. Look at this. Never tries to over hit. It's just a punch. But as soon as she gets to the pitch of the ball, punches it down the ground, skids away across the turf. That's really good batting. Taking on. Down the track. Straight. Oh, there was a chance. It went straight to Nasha Sanda. And when you get both hands to it, it's never easy off your own bowling. You should back yourself to take it. But again, Hunter's hit it well. Actually, maybe just the one hand she got to it. Oh, oh, she saved. Look at the turn on offer. This is ragged square. Almost could have been given as a wide, possibly. Would have been harsh on the young leg spinner, in fairness. Beautiful seam position. Hunter does well to get back. Remember, she's already been stumped. Nice stroke. This is a good shot. Very well weighted for Prendergast getting deep in the crease. She's going to get four. Placing it beautifully. Yep. Just realizing the length, probably not much of the footwork, but those quick hands playing coming into play, and the placement was perfect right between the two fielders. Again, this time, no worries for Pakistan. Muniba doing a good job behind the stumps. It's looking very dangerous. Way too early out of the blocks. Far away from the delivery as well. And Muniba Ali had ample time to take those bails off. Oh, that's a smart shot. That's very well done. She got outside the line of the ball and there's always a boundary on it. The previous delivery, she came down the track, this time staying and going deep, going across. She knew exactly where the fielder was. Easy picking for her. That's gone through those four fielders inside the circle on the offside. But again, that outfield, look at the ball just dying out. It's heavy. Older. And just as we're having a shuffle here in the commentary box, Laura Delaney has lost. This one's just skidded on. Delaney goes across the line and pays the price. Yeah, not the right choice of short. 
when the ball is keeping low, you look to play straight. Asha Sandush has bowled a brilliant spell into her fourth over, just 12 runs. It's a good start. It's tried different things and that's gone through. That is an excellent start by Emma. That will run down. Yes, it does. Given is not out, but then given is like, boys, no bat, no glove involved. Down the track, into the gap, brilliantly placed. That is an excellent shot by Amy Hunter. Again, gets to the pitch of the ball. No fear of using her feet, feet at all. There's no fear full stop, is there, for Amy Hunter. Oh, why am I so hell now? It's lost. I'll try the off -stand. That's out. That's an easy dismissal. Well, the wide is going to be signalled, so a run to the total for Ireland, but a disaster losing Hunter at a critical time. She's used her feet so frequently, I think the Pakistani bowlers have preempted this, both Prendergast. All the angle also. This one is heaved. That's nicely placed. That is beautiful. This is exactly what she's done. Hit up into the arc, and nearly out of the park. It's a good strike, that one. Four from the moment that it left the bat. These are important runs for Ireland. It's just amazing to see. Amen Anwar is back, and as you wrote, this one is heaved into the gap. But they've gone back to pace on, and Richardson says thank you very much. That's a good strike. This has been impressive from Ireland's middle order. I wondered after the dismissals, starting to soar. Again, length picked up very nicely into the gap. That is fantastic batting. First time in this innings, it's above seven and over. And I just wonder, are Ireland playing themselves into a position where they might not just take the match, they could take a quite incredible series win. Picked up nicely, there is a fielder. Ah, oh, she never misses those. That's a wonderful catch. It's a very good catch because this is firmly struck. Richardson probably trying to get it a little bit square. Gets into it. Oh, that should be taken, should be taken is taken nicely done by umaima sohil there and this is a classic dismissal from her just pushing it through watching the batter intently finding the leading edge and this is a simple catch held that's a good ball that yorker length so important to bowl those yorkers in those death overs and excellent running she's come back for second oh oh she couldn't make it she couldn't make it that's that's an easy one and good awareness from the long on fielder to see that little was the one that was struggling Picked up cleanly and she took a look up and she said, yeah, I've got to go to the keeper's end. And the keeper does the modern way, comes in front of the stumps, gets back. Little was always short. Good delivery. Been picked up nicely. There is no one there. That's a great way to end the inning. A boundary for Rebecca. That's a wonderful shot. So 17 overs have gone. 118 what Ireland have managed after losing seven wickets. They'll not be, a, not be that happy. Because they, at one point we all thought that might they might get to 130, but in the end, Fatma Sana and Nidadar, courtesy getting wickets, restricting Irish Island batters to 118.